Hello everyone, Mystic here. Welcome back to Slime Rancher. Straight away, I have to say, recording's messed up and I couldn't record what I did last time. This means, sadly, you missed out on the ending. However, with the ending, it's not the worst thing because the fact is, Slime Rancher's ending uses copyrighted music. So, it works out in the end either way, as I couldn't even play the ending if I wanted to. Let's see. Mochi or Bob? Mochi. A dervish and free phosphor for, honestly, a fair bit. And, looks like now we can buy a slime key. The whole goal is, as also in the failed recording, I actually did get the final food type that I needed and had begun doing a bit of work. I actively know one thing that I want to do. That's one, two, three, one. Well, failed to pick up the mint mangoes and that, but I can pick them up real soon. So this is just going to be kind of doing standard work, but my main goals are as follows. I want to upgrade my Z rank. The amount I need, though, is quite a bit, if I remember. I believe it's around 20, where I get what I'm after. Okay, I have plenty of Hunter and Biotechnicality Quantum Plots. Okay. You will stop trying to become, well, non-existent. There we go. You're going to rise, you're going to drop. You're going to drop as well. Hmm. 
a lot of these I'm going to be putting in by the looks of it. That's going to be nowhere near enough. Trust me. Hmm. It's all just a matter of trying to get all these that are going to drop in before they drop. Once they drop, they're not going to be as good for my value. With 7Z, all that money I just made is gone. So it's time to make more.
so much money. Just so much money. Gonna have about 20 grand. And yet we're still not done with sorting out all of our money. Because of course we still got more crystal, honey, and quantum blocks. And sorry if this is a lot shorter of a video after all the editing. But for the most part it's just managing the place, making sure that nothing's going to be wrong. So yeah, it's essentially now micromanagement for most of this until I get what I'm after. So let's clear out all these quantum ports. There we go. Check here. No. Okay. Another thing that I couldn't get via recording was silver parsnips. Bringing most of the food to completion in terms of having. Another thing of major notoriety, if I run over here, is the lab. Where I could physically make stuff and buy things to, um, well, make. Thing is, with a lot of these, I'm just going to buy them now because they're not going to be needed. So, make an A for me. <laughs> so, if I just go back here and put down my A for me. Let's, uh, let's handle all these Elder Roof Strolls and Elder Hands. As well as, um, let's just handle the Stony Hand Count. Fun fact, if you want an achievement, that's an achievement right there. Just throw an Elder Hen or Elder Roostro into an incinerator. Hmm. How did you get out? Get in there. Weird. There we go. Let's see. Ogden or Fora? Let's go with Fora. More crystals and a tangle plot. In the end, I'm going to say, don't really need a worry. That's most of the money gone again. So, I also unlocked the treasure cracker. 
which I'll get. And this slime key, 25,000 in order to get. Far, far too much money at our moment. But now, deep brine, salt of the earth kind of stuff. Stone. It's both solid and squishy at the same time. Aha! There's a fossil. I can't believe I'm somehow doing this, but this works. Oh, we got a new blueprint, a new teleporter type. Yes, we can make teleporters. Oh, we got yet another one, the grey teleporter. Oh, there it is. And of course, with their teleporters, are also the warp depots. Slime fossil. Fish tree could smile, it would look like this. So, teleporters. Most of these are unique. There we go. You might be questioning in here, the fabricating gadget section, where is it? Well, you can scroll through the five different types up top there to different things, including Gordo snares. With the teleporters, any normal teleporter requires a strange diamond, which is a rare item to find. <laughs> Other than that, it needs particular things like the coloured plot, depending on what colour it is, and something similar. So, say for example, the butterscotch teleporter, it's all yellow and sandy colouring, so it needs silky sand. The blue teleporter, well, it's blue, it needs indigonium. And with pink, well, you find pinks primarily in the first area, and deep brine is located in the first area. In the end, these teleporters are going to be very useful. Not as useful as drones. I would need a lot of plots, as you can see. Here's where the real fun begins.
sound like a very poor thing to say, given what this all is, but I think we're going to end the episode here already. It's rather short, yes, but the thing is about this episode is it's mostly just me explaining about how the recording prior failed, and more importantly, about what most of this is just going to be, which is all micromanagement. So, yeah. There we go. Let me just get rid of all these. Yeah, for now, I think I'll call it there. A lot of what will be happening is just micromanagement to try and upgrade our Z level. As there is a majorly notable reason as to why. But, until that time comes, this is Mystic. And next time, we'll be progressing further with our micromanagement before we can truly take advantage of what we gain as a post-game. So, I'll see you all then. Goodbye.